Howdy ho there, chums. It is I, Captain Stephen XO. Yes, and we are on my desert dune bug planet in creative mode. And yet you can see all the dune bugs over there. Look at them. Look at them. There's loads of them. Loads. I'm infested with dune bugger creatures. Anyway, what I'm going to be doing in this episode, chums, is I'm going to be jumping to a lot of my old creative bases and we're going to be giving them a bit of a delete because people in my comment section have been saying, Captain Steve, you're limited to 20,000 base parts. Well, I think I've gone over that. I've got 50 bases and um, between them all, they, they do have quite a lot of base parts. So I'm going to keep this base, but we're going to go to some of my older bases that I built freaking eons ago and we're going to go delete a couple. Right, so your bases... And let's have a quick look, see, because I've I've done loads of loads and loads of bases. Let's start from the bottom, shall we? Dung beetle portal base. Want to keep that? NMSA dog. I think I keep that. Archives base. Handy. US capital. That's a nice one. Tie fighter base. I quite like that one as well. These aren't these. Are, they're my newest bases. Let's start at the top. Okay. Let's get rid of the Doc Tom base. This one I built for. Um, the appreciation for COVID nurses and all that sort of stuff. But that event's over now, so we're going to delete that. Let's go. Okay, right here. Awesome. I have arrived. Brilliant. Okay, this is my base computer. That's my base over there. Let's see if I can get there in camera mode. Let me just show you what's inside here. If it actually renders, it probably won't. But let's uh, head on in. And yeah, what I've got in here is uh, little droids that sort of help out with medical examinations. There you go. There's a little... There's a little droid moving about the place. Lovely. Hello there, number five. Yep, I went for a short circuit type vibe. Oh, we've gone in a door there. And there's one on charge there. Hello there, little droid. And then through here, there's like a, an observation -y area and herbal medicines and all that sort of shenanigans going on. But yeah, there's like these little bays where they can monitor patients and things in these little rooms and stuff. So yeah, it's um, like a little hospital ward. That's the idea behind it. So yeah, that, I built that one for the whole, um, that was the part of the PBF. But anyway, we're going to delete that, so let's uh, get rid of that one. Yeah, goodbye base. Now really, I should do this from the Nexus, because after I delete the base, then I'm back at the Nexus console, and I can just keep doing it from there. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to head on up to the Nexus, and then we're going to delete some more of these bases, but i give you a little quick showcase of each before they disappear into the ether and are gone for good. Okay, so I'll see you guys up in the Nexus. Cheery bye for now. Cheery bye for now. How do? Right, okay. Well, I'm up at this big nasty looking portal. Let's uh, fire it up. Hello there, doohickey. Right, okay, so my base is your base. Is lovely jubbly. Okay, well, that's a bit odd. These ones have both got the same screenshot of the base I just deleted. Well, let's try this one then. And let's see what's actually there. Okay, let's go. Right, awesome. Oh, I remember this one. This is where I did a base off against Professor Cynical, I believe. So let's go into camera mode, and I lost. This was my, my uh, little Christmassy type base. So I've done these little huts, like uh, little stands, yeah, where um, you can come and get all your Christmassy bits from. And some of them are games. It's like this one's a shooting gallery where you have to shoot the targets to get points. And there's like the guns on the walls over there, you know. And then over here, I think this is like a, a bar or something. Oh no, this is Hook a Duck. Hook a Duck, this one. So you control that robot arm and you have to grab like a virtual duck. Yeah, and then there's uh, this one over here, which is... I don't know what that one is. A fortune teller. Fortune teller. Yeah, that's a fortune teller's one. So there's just this one over here. I think this is like a food vendor -y type one. Yeah, food vendor -y one. Yeah, and then we've got a Christmas tree in the middle. How lovely. Awesome. Right, okay, well that, that one can be uh, deleted. So yeah, let's, let's go delete that one. Sweet. Okay, goodbye base. You're gone. Zap. Gone, dilly, gone, gone. Gone, gone. Oh, there's a rainbow. Nice, nice. Very, very nice. Okay, right, so. Well, this is quite a beautiful planet, actually. Lo what lovely vistas. Nice. Like it. I've used the word nice far too many times now, chums. Right, so I should have the teleport back to Nexus button. Heck yes, I do. Yes, I've got another one in the same system. Let's go there. Gek Mountain, then. Let's see what's underneath this screenshot. There we go. Yeah, Let's go. Well, I have awesome. arrived at my other base. Let's have a quick look. Let's put the sun in the sky. Oh, it's this one. I tried to make a sky base where you could actually land on the landing pads. And that's really weird. That's all gone strange. It used to have landing pads there, not in the middle, and over here. So that is proper odd. It never did work anyway. 
it was so yeah it, it can go um, but the actual base computer for this I think is actually on the surface of the planet I think I think it's below me uh, you let's let's head on over it's been a long time since I visited here so I think the base is all the way down there oh my days we've got giant striders down here let's go down let's have a look see it's creative mode don't even need to worry about my jetpack wow they are big they're pretty damn freaking huge actually aren't they okay well let's go into camera mode let's have a look at one of these put the sun to sky let's go and have a quick look at one of these awesome creatures so that's a baby one and that stands a lot taller than me let's have a look at one of the adults so this is a strange sort of mouth setup it's got and how many eyes does it freaking need well that's pretty darn cool isn't it i like that creature there's a lot going on there there's a lot of attention to detail on this creature I like the scales on the legs that is so cool uh, that is really cool awesome creature okay well let's um let's get rid of the base computer anyway right out so this can be deleted lovely jubbly delete gone gone deadly gone 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 yeah awesome that's a that is a cool planet though isn't it I don't think I'm gonna miss it you know I don't, I don't think I'll miss it right anyway let's uh, head back to the old Nexus pow okay chums well this was a compact test base basically it's got a landing pad above it and then everything sits underneath it's a very small awesome little base but it was just a test design to see if i could build something in normal mode so we're going to go there and probably get rid of that okay, one right. as well. well i've arrived and I, I don't remember it being this nasty on this planet that's there's terrible weather conditions all right okay well let's um let's head on into um the old camera mode let me just show you what this base looks like so yeah it's it's got this sort of uh, array going on inside which is quite cool and that there it's it's quite a homely comfortable sort of base with these lighting panels that sort of sit in between that almost make it look like this pad is hovering i do really like this base it, it is quite a nice one as far as my bases go this one is very compact and has a lot going for it but it doesn't really serve any real purpose and in creative mode it's not something that i'm going to be utilizing at any time in normal mode i probably would have kept this it's, it's a nice little base so let's uh, head on over and it's something that i will have to replicate in the future for a base it's a nice little base right so there we go let's uh, delete this one sweet and uh, delete a mondo it's kind of why I, I would like to see it where if you did make a base in creative mode you could save the blueprint and restore it into say normal because there's definitely a base that i would have loved to have had in normal mode and i wouldn't mind paying like 500 quicksilver or something to restore it you know maybe they could come with a, a price depending on what you go and install right okay i don't know what's going on there with that cloud of smoke it's probably my ship yeah look at it just floating in midair there fantastic anyway i'll see you guys back at the nexus there we go nexus button kapow well thank you very much for watching this video and if you like what you see please hit a like or a subscribe and yeah or you can support my channel through patreon here are all my patreon backers thanking you patreon and i also have youtube membership if you want to sign over to youtube membership check out my video links in my video description I also have merch, grab yourself a fine and dandy pair of socks, a mug or a t-shirt over at my merch store, or I also have Atlas cards that I sometimes have at my eBay store, check out my video description. <coughs> so that is the end, thank you for watching and please hit a join or a subscribe or just hit one of these tiles on the screen as you see here now, stay with Captain Steve a bit longer. <coughs>